Hello everyone, I'm Alistair and welcome back to the my bald must effect. Yes, my head is shiny and magnificent. Yes, last time we saved the uh, Terra Nova from the Batarian attack with this bloody asteroid that we are currently on. And we are just leaving, going to the Citadel because I wanted to finish this one assignment. Yes. This reporter's request with Fist OSD. We are gonna deliver that and we will see what will happen. Oh, this is not the way out. Yes, yes, it's down there. Okay, so we are going to Citadel, look around what's going on, maybe talk to our crewmates a little bit, and then we will go straight to Pharos or Noveria. I'm not a hundred percent sure which one. Where the bloody hell is the exit? Okay, he's on the other other side. Okay, let's go. My shiny head. Let's go forward and conquer everyone who stands in our way. Commander, urgent message from Alliance Command coming in. I'll patch it through. Shepard, this is Admiral Hackett from Alliance Command. Oh, my old friend, We've got Admiral a situation Hackett. Here and you're the only one that can handle it. How can I help? What do you need, Admiral? There's an Alliance training ground where we test weapons and technology and live fire simulations. One of the VIs we use to simulate enemy tactics in the drills is no longer responding to our override commands. It's gone rogue. Have you, have you Are gone you rogue? telling me this computer is thinking on its own? We're not stupid, Shepard. This is a virtual intelligence, not a true AI. It's not self-aware, and it can't access any external systems. We didn't do anything illegal here. Virtual intelligence support is critical to our military success. VIs process thousands of status reports and react in nanoseconds. No human can do that. We Fair need enough. you to fight your way through the training ground of the VI core and manually disable it. Can't you disable it remotely? Our fail safes aren't responding. The VI operates on a closed network. It can affect any external systems, but we don't have any direct access to its processes. We could bomb it from orbit, but the damage to the facility would be catastrophic. We'd prefer to have someone shut down the core. Someone like you. I know Spectre's answered the council, but you're still... So a surgical human. strike it is. You're still part of the If you can call me a surgeon, and then... right now, we need you. The VI controls all the facility's weapons, drones, and automated defenses. You're the only one that can pull this off, Shepard. I am the only one. Good luck. Thanks, Admiral Hackett. So maybe we will have a slight detour to do that assignment. That's definitely a side quest, but an uh, interesting one. I don't remember that much about it. It was quite a long time ago. But yeah, probably we'll go to do that and then go to Noveria or Ferros. But in the meantime, we are here on the Citadel, the jewel of the galaxy. Let's go find that, uh, what it was, a uh, reporter, journalist, yeah. Let's go. And who should I take with me? Uh, Liara, definitely, and, or not Rex. Sounds alright. Equalizing interior <coughs> pressure with exterior atmosphere. Logged. The commanding officer is ashore. Exo, Exo Presley, Presley has the deck. deck. Oh, I remember this prick. Let's have a chat, shall we? Rear Admiral Mihailovic, Fifth Fleet. Should I ask him straight away what do you want? Nah, I'll be slightly nice to him. Just Commander Shepard, SSB Normandy. You don't know who I am, do you, Commander? Uh, I know my who you are, but I don't care. Scout Flotilla. You and the Normandy were slated for my unit after shakedown. And the council got their paws, claws, tentacles, whatever. They got them on our ship and you. I still serve the Alliance, sir. As a Spectre, I can advance our interests to the council. Hmm. You still know what color your blood is, Shepard? I don't insult begrudge me. the politician's decision to throw you to the council. It's an opportunity. I do begrudge this over-designed piece of tin, though. The Normandy is a fine ship, sir. She's served us well so far. It's a gimmick, Commander. Useless in a stand-up fight. This you sure about experiment that? experiment diverted billions from our appropriations bills for the same price we could have had a heavy cruiser. 
But no, we had to make nice to the Turians, throw money at a co-developed boondoggle. I'm here to make an inspection, Commander. Normandy is an Alliance warship. I intend to see she's up to snuff. All right, then. We'd be honored to show her to you, Admiral. Do as you want. I'll just bet. Don't right take here. too long. I don't have all day. Bitch. Commander, I'm not happy. I Sounds bet. Like a fairly common situation. <laughs> Commander, I suggest you secure your mouth. It's going to get you in trouble. Who designed that CIC? Putting the commander aft of everyone else is inefficient. What if he needs to discuss with the operators toward the bow? Modified Turian style. They prefer commanders looking over their subordinates rather than in the middle of them. We wanted to see how effectively they can command with that setup. Hmm. Reasonable goal, but they should have studied that in a lab rather than on a frontline warship. I had to shake my head at that drive core of yours. 120 billion credits of element zero to make this thing able to move without giving itself away. You realize we could make drive cores for 12,000 fighters with that money? What good is it to hide for a Quantity few hours anyway? is not always You're the best way. Over the quality, you should know that. Men of limited vision said the same thing about early aircraft, submarines, and tanks. There's two ways I could take that, Commander, but that is true. I suppose the early U-boats weren't much better. And we need to talk about your crew, Commander. Krogan? Asari? Turians? What are you thinking, Commander? You can't allow oh, alien careful with that free tone. I don't to like that. Equipment. I'm Normandy's commanding officer. The reg state I have the authority to say who does and doesn't come aboard. If you disagree, send a complaint up the chain of command. Sorry, <laughs> Commander. You know I'm right. You want them on board? No, you are not right, Matt. Don't quote regs at me. Yeah, I will. You have anything else to say, Commander? Yeah, fuck Any off. Any other justifications for the state of oh, this vessel? Oh, I can't do this, unfortunately. None, Very well. I don't agree with any of this, but your reasons seem sound. I'll be submitting a report to the Joint Military Council. It will not be as negative as I right. planned. Is that all? Good hunting, Commander Shepard. Peace off. Make us proud. Peace off, Admiral Mikhailovich. What an ass. Okay. A Solarian excavation team has run into an unexpected problem after unearthing a Prothean dig site. Hanar protesters have blockaded the dig site, claiming that artifacts of the Enkindlers, as the Hanar call Commander Shepard, I have a call. To you. This is Lieutenant Girard down in the docking bay. There is a woman here. Uh, she was rescued from Batarian slavers a few weeks ago. She is from Mindwar. I guess she was taken in the raid on your town. Oh, I don't remember having this quest before or how to call it. Hmm, how can I help? She's been a slave for the past 13 years. Is she all right? Not really. She's a little messed up. She got of course she wouldn't be all right after 13 years in slavery, but yo. Now she's holed up here in the docking bay. She, uh, she says she wants to die. I hoped you'd talk to her. It's a long shot, but you went through the same thing. The raid. I figured maybe you could talk her out of her tree. Oh, of course I help. I'm, on my I'm way a bad motherfucker, but I will help people that Anything need it. Anything you could do would be great. I don't want to. Uh, she's been through enough. I'll have my men stand by for you. All right, we will go check that too. And here is Kalisa Algilani, the infamous uh, journalist in quotations. I don't like her. I would like to punch her in the face, but Kalisa let's talk. Seen in Algelani, Westernland News. Would you answer a few questions for our viewers? Uh, depends. What sort of questions? People back home have heard a lot of wild stories about you, Commander. I can give you the chance to set the record straight. What do you say? Hmm. Some topics are classified. So long as you understand that I may not be able to answer all questions. I'm sure our viewers will understand. I'm sure you don't understand. Humans have been trying to get the respect of the galactic community for 26 years. With that in mind, what are your feelings on being the first human specter? Hmm. It's just another I job. I try to keep in mind that it's just another form of duty. But I still wear a uniform. But there's a difference between protecting human interests and citadel interests. Have you encountered any situations where the citadel asked you to place its needs before the needs of Earth? The council is concerned with the needs of the whole galactic community. We're part of that community now. Our needs are on their agenda, but we're one of many. You really do believe that, don't you? You've been given command of an advanced human warship for your missions. 
Is there anything you'd like to say about it? Hmm. Yeah, the Turians helped build it. Actually, the Normandy was co-developed by human and Turian engineers. Its design incorporates many innovations, all of which are classified, I'm afraid. So, the Turians have knowledge of the Normandy that is being kept secret from the Alliance public? Yes. Do you think it was appropriate to hand Earth's most advanced warship over to the Citadel? No, I command the Normandy. Miss Algelani, I wear the Alliance uniform. And if you think anyone other than me says where the Normandy can go, you're sadly mistaken. No offense intended, Oh, Commander. no offense. You definitely want sure to offend. I'm sure you have to follow the orders of your superiors. Of course, now your superiors are aliens. <laughs> and here we are again. One last question, Commander. What about no? Rumors back home say you're tracking a rogue specter named Saren. Do you have any comment on that? I'm afraid I can't comment on whatever my current assignment may or may not be. Don't worry. We'll find out. The eyes of Earth are on you. Don't let us down. Thank you for your time, Commander Shepard. All right, now piss off. I don't like that bitch. Not in this game. Not in the other, any other game. Okay. Uh, I think I know where to find that journalist that we need to visit to uh, give her or him the d -d 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 data from Fist. So let's go. Out of court with Yep, here I am. I'm Emily Wong. I'm a journalist investigating corruption on the Citadel. You recently took down a man named Fist, reportedly a member of some sort of organized yeah, crime. Sure, group. I did. Did you find any evidence in his office? Is there anything you can share with me? Hmm, I found some discs. These OSDs might have the information you're looking for. <laughs> You've got Fist files? This could be even bigger than I'd hoped. Here, Commander, for your trouble. Oh, cheers. Now, if you'll excuse me, I should go see what's on these discs. Hope you won't get killed. <laughs> okay, uh, that's I think everything I wanted to do on the Citadel. So let's go to the docking bay and talk to that uh, slave girl that expe uh, that escaped. Commander, glad to see you. Okay, where is she? She's back there. Yes, sir. Behind those shipping containers. I've got a sniper position, but I don't think we'll need it. She's only a danger to herself. We've got a sedative to calm her down, but we can't get close to her. Every step we take gets her more yep. wound up. Okay, I'll take care of her. I hope I don't need it. Tell your men to stand by. Don't push her too hard. If she seems liable to pull the trigger, back off or walk away. I am willing to wait her out. All right. Good luck, Commander. Hello. Stop! Stop! What are you? What are you? My name is Shepard. Lieutenant Gerard sent me to talk to you. What's your name? Animals don't get names. The masters put their symbols on her. Hot metal all over her back. She screams when they do it. You're not an animal. Your parents. Body batarians. They, they messed her up. Them? Quite badly. She, a lot of things. she speak about Not herself in a third person. It's not a good sign. That. She She doesn't remember the rest. Leave her alone. I'm going to take a step towards you now. Okay? No, she's no good. Don't want to be handled again. Okay, tell me about... about the raid. What's the last thing you remember from Mindwar? Fires. Smells of smoke and burning meat. Animals screaming as the masters cage them. As they put the metal to their backs. Put the wires in their brains. She pretends to be dead. If she's dead, she can't work. But they know! She hopes they'll leave. But they put her in the pen. She didn't fight. She was already broken when they put the wires in. The past is the past. You couldn't have fought them off when you were a child. They were bigger than you. There were more of them. They would have killed you. She wants to believe that. She wants to believe nothing would change. She doesn't want to be there anymore. In the pen. In the cages. Lying quiet while they do things to her. 
Okay, okay I'll take a step towards I'm you. I'm going to take a step towards you now. Okay? With the same animation. <laughs> and the same weird goes up. She doesn't want... Don't touch her! Hmm. What about your parents? What happened to your parents? There's... She sees them. They're yelling. Run! Hide! They hit the masters. But the masters, they have lights and hoses. Daddy's... He's melting! They killed her parents. Bastards. She doesn't want to see that! Don't make her look! Don't look! Stupid! Stupid! Be strong. I don't want to hear that. You survived 13 years in a slave pen. You're strong enough to deal with a memory. She's not strong. She's weak and stupid. All humans are. That's what the master said. I like why, uh, she how she's pointing with that can. <laughs> Mommy and Daddy. Burning in white light. Melting. Going to pieces. They can't even say anything to her. They're dead, Shepard. They try to save her, and the masters burn them. Can she stop remembering now, please? I will take a step towards you. I'm going you. to take a step towards you now. With the same animation. Okay. And the same weird close-up again. <laughs> yes, I was right. <laughs> please don't touch her. She's dirty. No worries. I won't it. touch her. I won't touch you. You are not dirty. Uh, but the, my childhood. I yeah. was on Mindwar. My parents died in the raid. Lying! You get hit for lying! Get the buzz or the burning! Can't be there. Why are you alive? Why are you? Why aren't you like her? Broken. Only fit to dig and carry. Nobody breaks me. Yeah, that's me. I fought. My whole family fought and got hit by an artillery strike for their trouble. I got buried under rubble. If they saw me, they left me for dead. Dead animals can't work. You lose your mommy and daddy, but you don't dig, you don't carry. You stand up. She wishes she could stand up. Hmm. Give her the sedative. Yeah. Talitha, this will make you sleep. If you fall asleep, they'll take you to a place where you can get better. Yum, 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 yum. Will she have bad dreams? No dreams. This is powerful stuff. You won't dream at all. She'd like that. It hurts when she... When I remember... Me. But she wants I to... hope you will be alright. They will take care of you. Lieutenant Girard? Is it over, Commander? Yes. She took the sedative. She wants to get better, Lieutenant. Thanks, Commander. That means a lot. I didn't want to hurt her. It's just when I see her curled into a ball and shivering. She was only six when they took her. Why the hell are we out here if we can't even keep one little girl safe? Hmm. That was hard. Bad things happen to good people, Lieutenant. That's why you and I are here. Don't wring your hands over her. Help her. Yes, sir. Thanks for your help, Commander. We are taking her Glad to, to a help. counseling center. They'll help her get better. I hope so. I'm off to my mission. And my mission is a uh, rogue VI. So I need to go to the soul system. Okay, so we are going to visit the... Not exactly the Earth, but we are going to visit the moon. The other side of the moon. Stand by, shore party. Decontamination in yeah, progress. get closer to the door, it will open uh, quicker. <laughs> Alright. The commanding officer is straight aboard. to the galaxy map. No time to waste. Relieved. Message coming in. You another message. Patching it through. Commander Ms. Algelani's story on you just aired. Ah, yes. She shouldn't have ambushed you like that. But you handled it the right way. I hope I've so. I've never had to deal with the press before. You shouldn't have to. This won't happen again, Commander. We have a press corps so personnel don't have to deal with her kind of BS. <laughs> Just wanted to let you know what the response was back home. Thanks, Admiral Hackett. I'll keep you any longer. Fifth Fleet out. 
I love the dead mirror. It's perfect. Alright, so the soul system this. It's soul system local cluster. Yes. That that looks amazing. For detailed information, please refer to the standard issue Alliance Galactic Codex. Earth orbit is riddled with debris generated by bootstrap space development. Use of kinetic barriers is recommended at altitudes over 85 kilometers. <laughs> Alright, but I want to go to the moon, yeah, Luna. An early source of helium-3, Luna is now mined for materials used in space habitat construction. Two dozen major stations have been constructed at Earth's L4 and L5 Lagrange points, all from, all from lunar resources. 4.1 million people, nice. Let's land. Let's get rid of that rogue VI. This should be fun. Yeah, Rex and... hmm... It will take Tally this time with me. Yeah. It's really hard to choose the companions, I love them all. They are so greatly written, those characters. Okay, but first, we need to level up. Training ground. Please strap in and wait. We will be in a destination in 15 minutes. Have a nice trip. Try us. That's it. Let's disembark. Oh, there are three of them. Okay, so I think I will need to clean all of them. One by one. Anyone home? Probably not. Hopefully no one died here. Okay, let's decrypt this quickly. Power junction, should I destroy that? I think yes. Or maybe not. Okay, whatever. Ah yeah, I can smell the enemies. died there. That would be unfortunate. I think that's it. What do we have here? Ah, oh, VI company. Toxic gas is being went into the bunk bunkers. Okay. So I need to be quick. About it.
Nope. I didn't want to find that guy right there. The lights on the optical mainframes frequently die. The first of the three computing clusters containing the VI is offline. Okay, so the first bunker is off. Let's proceed to the other one, other two. I like the creepy music behind it, in the background. <laughs> I remember the first time that I was playing this game on some spot I was quite scared and that's not even the horror game. But that's the case, I think I don't like horror games. Okay, where's my Mako? I don't really need to destroy those power junctions, so leave them be. Where are you hiding? Ooh, my shield is down already. I ho hope it saved it there. Oh, fuck it. I should have saved it. Alright, here we go again. Defends you. Your heart rate head up this point, interpreting into a series of zeros and ones. They repeat again and again, blanketing all frequencies until the lights on the final. We I cluster flicker and die. Your specialization class will replace your base class in the talents on the squad screen. Talent ranks in your base class transfer over to your specialization class. Go to your squad screen and view. Okay. Oh. So I can choose the Nemesis or the Bastion. Nemesis. The Nemesis is a biotic specialist who uses mass effect fields to inflict heavy damage against the opponents. So it improves my warp, lift, and duration and damage of all, for all biotic abilities. And Bastion uses biotics for defense or for opponent immobilization. Improves barrier stasis and reduces recharge time of, on all biotics. I'll go for Bastion. Okay, so we purged the VI. I think that's it. We'll see when we get out of this complex what will happen. But probably that's it, the Admiral Hackett will contact us and gr congratulate us on our good job. At least that's what I think will happen. Let's see. I think it's done. Yeah, I don't have it here anymore. Okay, so let's return to the Normandy. Nothing? Maybe when I open the galaxy map. Nope. No message. Well, no congratulations there. 
All right, never mind. So let's go to the Novaria. That's our next destination in our main quest. Yes, here, Pax. Pax system, Novaria, the planet. Love that sound. <laughs> Alright, Noveria is a small frozen terrestrial world barely habitable by conventional definitions. It is privately chartered by the Noveria Development Corporation who lease these out labs to perform research too dangerous or controversial to be performed elsewhere. Given Noveria's unique situation, it is the source of many wild conspiracy theories. Okay, let's land here and see what's going on. Approach control, this is the SSV Normandy, requesting a vector and a berth. Normandy, your arrival was not scheduled. Oh, right. Our defense grid is armed and tracking you. State your business. Citadel business. We got a council specter aboard. Landing access granted, Normandy. Be advised, we will be confirming identification on arrival. If confirmation cannot be established, your vessel will be impounded. Well, you can try that. Bunch. I think I'll take my next leave here. <laughs> yeah, seems like a lovely place to spend your holidays. Okay, let's quick save. Maybe I should uh, talk a little bit to my crewmates. Yes, Commander? Speak freely, Presley. I want to know if you have a problem with non humans. It's not that, Commander. <laughs> Humanity has always handled its Some own people problem. think asking for help is a I sign. I guess so. Maybe I'm just... Carry on, Presley. Yes, sir. <laughs> okay, it's... Rex and Liara Tassoni. These will be my companions on the mission on Noveria. Equalizing interior pressure with exterior atmosphere. atmosphere. Logged. The commanding officer is ashore. Exo, Exo Presley, Presley has, has the, the deck. deck. <laughs> I heard that a lot. Where's the welcoming party? Yeah, here they are. Hello, dear. Please don't make me shoot you. That's far enough. Hmm. Step aside. I'm on important business. This is an unscheduled arrival. I need your credentials. Hmm. I am with the council. I'm a specter. My name is Shepard. Load of horse crap, man. Oh, shut the we fuck will up. We need to confirm that. Also, I must advise you that firearms are not <laughs> not happening. Sergeant Sterling, secure their weapons. <laughs> not a chance. Don't try it. Oh, I love Rex. <laughs> I'm keeping my gun. Nobody takes my weapon. Charge and lock. We are authorized to use lethal force. You have to the count of three to surrender your weapons. I'm authorized to blow One, your fucking face off. Two, three. Captain Matsuo, stand down. We confirm their identity. Spectres are authorized to carry weapons here, Captain. You may proceed, Spectre. Fuck off. I hope the rest of your visit will be less confrontational. Parasini-san will meet you upstairs. Why you less confrontational? I like this fun. I would like to shoot you. <laughs> For no apparent reason. <laughs> no, right. And I like this concrete aesthetics. It looks very, really, really... Dystopian and brutalist. Hello. I am Gianna Parasini, assistant nice to, to meet you. Analeas. We apologize for the incident in the docking bay. Hmm. Uh, I'll be nice. I appreciate your help. You're welcome. You understand our security chief was only. Doing I don't care. Job. One of my duties is orientation of new arrivals. Do you have any questions? 
Hmm, I heard there were cats here. Has anyone unusual passed through here recently? Unusual? And a sorry matriarch passed through a few days ago, Lady Benezia. Benezia. Liana's mother. She is here. Can I speak with her? Benezia left for the Peak 15 research complex days ago. Of to course. The best of my knowledge, that catch. She's still there. Hmm. I don't need the directions. Tell me how to get there? You'll need to ask Administrator Analeas for clearance to leave this port. Okay, where can I find that schmuck? Where can I find the Administrator? His office is on the main level, left at the top of the elevator. Hmm, alright, thank you can very much. Of course. If you need any help, you can ask me at the Administrator's oh, office. Oh, sure, I will. She is here. I can't believe it. Don't worry, Liara, we will I find her. I you want to talk to me, Shepard. About my mother. No, don't worry. No, I don't. I trust you, Liara. You may not be military, but you're part of my crew. Thank you, Shepard. That means a great deal to me. See? I said that would be nice. Okay, thanks for watching. I will leave this episode here. If you like the video, please push that like button. Leave me some comments down below. And I will see you in the next one. Bye-bye!